What's up everybody? Welcome back to Malabar Toy where safety is number one priority and today I'm going to show you how to make DIY cube out of matches. Without glue it's gonna stack up perfectly with the beautiful pattern cube matches. Let's check this out. So what you want to do is get a couple of small rubber bands. If you don't have small rubber bands tie them like this so they make them smaller. We're going to get three matches and lay them like this. Then we're going to need a rubber band. And we're going to put a rubber band on this side and a rubber band on this side. Then we're going to get three more matches in this pattern and lay it like this. Once again, three more matches, one head on this side, so this time it's going to two heads on this side. And we're going to put it to the rubber band. You probably can already guess that I'm gonna get three more matches and put it over this way. Boom, just like that. Once again, three more matches, two heads on this side, so this time we're gonna put two heads on this side, put it to the rubber band. Now that we have some thick thickness on this matches, we're gonna lift them up and make that rubber band tighter so it holds. Make this rubber band tighter as well. Boom, now it's holding a little bit, so it's much easier to work with it. Okay, then we're gonna spread out some matches like this, and then we're just going to push two between these matches. One and two. Just like that, you see? Next match, then we're gonna flip it over. The next match is gonna go between here. Just like this. It is kind of messy right now, but once we're gonna continue, it's gonna look really good. Oh, it looks like I missed this one. You see, if you missed it, just pick it up, no big deal, and fix it. This is what it's supposed to look like. Then flip it over again, and third match is gonna go over here. Then this one is gonna go here, and then this one is gonna go here, and this one is gonna go here. And then we're gonna put another rubber band on it for it to hold everything. And then I'm gonna get another rubber band, and we can make it tight in the beginning, and then we can loosen it up later. Boom, just like this. Then we're going to flip it up over, and then we're going to grab another rubber band on this side. Boom, and that's what we got right here. Actually, we will need two more rubber bands, because we're going to put the rubber bands on each side of the matches. Then push it to here, and then flip it over, and push it to here. Simple, isn't it? Then I'm gonna put it to here and then to here. And then continue just editing layer after layer of matches. And that way, after about 30 minutes, you're going to have a cube. So this is how you add a layer. You see there's a square right here of six matches. I'm gonna grab a rubber band, put it on the outside going to grab another rubber band and lift it up and put it on this much and then continue put two boom and now I'm going to finish a layer on this side this is simple now that now the beginning was hard but now it's just time consuming and then you finish a layer on this side Here's a match, pull it all up, boom, you see you add a whole layer. I'm going to take off a couple rubber bands, so it will be a little bit easier to push matches to. Just going to continue what I was doing. Boom. 
now this way and you see it's going to get pretty tight once we're done it's going to be nice and tight and stay together all right and here it is much cube pretty awesome huh this much is a little bit too cheap so i wish i had a little bit better quality of matches but how cool is that diy much cube looks awesome doesn't it